Welcome back to the Mars Horizon demo. This is uh, video four. Let's get back into the game. Um, so tutorial mission operation. Build one rocket on a test pad, spacecraft, assembly facility, or research lab. Build mission control. Complete a request mission. So this is what we need to do. Um, build mission control. I think we go it here. Or maybe not. We're still building. Let's go back. Let's go next month. The technology hub of your space agency, the research lab, can greatly improve scientific yield for missions. Unlocks mission training science. Spacecraft assembly facility complete. Spacecraft assembly facility provides a clean room environment to aid in the development of complex mission payloads. Rocket test pad is complete. The rocket test pad will allow further and more rigorous vehicle engine tests with more reliable launches. With the training option now available for your missions, it's time to focus on another vital aspect of growing your agency, building and mission control. Continue. Uh, the mission control building unlocks an additional mission slot, allowing you to conduct two missions at the same time. A great way to increase your science and support income. Note that you may need to research another training building first. It's recommended to unlock all the training buildings, uh, all the training options eventually. So, I guess we have to do research, uh, buildings, and mission control. Oh, wait. What? What? We're not trained. What are we building now? What are we doing? Oh, we're doing this. Okay. But let's not do that yet. Um... Test launch. Artificial satellite. Phase one. Didn't we do this already? Leave Earth orbit. Requests. Test launch atmospheric sampling. Request missions often have special modifiers that make aspects of the mission more challenging, as well as increasing the potential rewards. Consider these carefully before choosing which request mission to attempt. Um, equip a basic orbital satellite with a radio transmitter, the emissions of which can be tracked around the globe. Okay. I don't think we can do that yet. Um, vehicles. Do we have... No, missions. How do we do... A radio transmitter then. We don't have an active mission base diplomacy. Hey, they're kind of happy with us, whoever that is. USA. China, not so much. Japan staying out of the argument. <laughs> On the diplomacy screen, you'll be able to set, see your relationship with each of the other agencies. Depending on your reputation with an agency, your re relationship can range from allied to antagonistic. Uh, relationship can be earned and lost through joint missions and certain events. Each type of relationship, apart from mutual grants, bonuses to your agency. Friendly and allied relationships boost science income and increase the other agency's joint mission contributions. Competing and ag antagonistic relationships boost funds, income, and reduce the other agency's joint mission contribution. Okay. They're kind of happy with us. We're friendly with NASA. Not so friendly with uh, Russia. Definitely neutral. It says neutral. We're definitely getting unfriendly with China. And Japan, as I said, stays out of it. Cool. So. we done that. we done that. Complete required research to plan mission. Request. Test launch atmospheric sampling. I'm not sure how... I don't remember how to do this, actually. Atmospheric sampling. Don't we just have to... 
I think we have to send a satellite up, right? We have to send a satellite up. There you go. Oh, uh, okay. Next event. Radiation belts discovered. Data from your recent artificial satellite mission has confirmed that belts have trapped radiation around Earth, shielding the planet from the sun's cosmic rays. 20 science gained. Nice. Next month. And our rocket is complete. Launch preparations. Training is a crucial part of the mission. I think we went over this last time, didn't we? So I don't think we need to... Do we need to train something? Available training options for this mission can be selected here. To unlock more training options, select the appropriate buildings in your base. Each training option focuses on a specific aspect of the mission. For example, payload reliability training will increase payload reliability. The total bonus granted by each training option is independent oh, is dependent on the number of months until the launch date. Okay, so launch reliability. Okay, let's try this. Training. Set a launch date. July. Your current training and its bonus can be viewed here. The bonus is determined by the number of months between the current state and the selected launch date. Choosing a later launch date can greatly increase your training bonus, yet may give other agencies the chance to complete milestone missions before you. I forgot to start the timer. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Um, July 5%. What I did that? Oh, we get 10% if I wait until August. Let's do that. Confirm mission setup. Two months we got. China achieves moon orbit. The news newspapers are dominated by the recent set of China's lunar orbit mission. Your agency has been approached for comment. Your PR team advised that praising the achievement will improve relationship with China, yet may open our agency to criticism of falling behind in the space race. Conversely, downplaying the mission may boost your public support, but damage relationships. Let's downplay it. Small capsule able to carry animals in space and a study of effects of spaceflight and living organisms. Cool. Uh, set research. Right, so we need to do mission control, I think, right? And next month. Now we have to launch. Well, I definitely think we need to work on our rocket reliability. That's not our fault. I mean, I don't know why it keeps blowing up. And it just... Just silly. We need to put an animal in space. We're never going to put a friggin' animal in space if we don't, you know. How are we going to put an animal in space if we can't even keep a rocket in the air? Select payload. Can we not do... Why is it like this one? Okay. And an orbital radio. I don't, I don't know how you do orbital radio. Could we do this too? Okay, next month. 
A local power rat is doing the construction of the ESRO2B payload for your upcoming ionospheric me uh, measurements mission has resulted in minor damage to one of its components. Your engineers have estimated a 5% reduction in reliability, which is currently 65%, unless the component is replaced at a cost of 100k. Let's leave it. Because it's only reduced to 60%. I think that's fine. I think it's okay. UFO fever. The discovery of debris likely belonging to a weather balloon has sparked a wave of conspiracy theories surrounding UFOs. Several questionable magazines have approached your agency for comment. Whilst your researchers urge di di dismissing such stories, your PR team has noted the potential for drumming up interest in space exploration. Get the support. We'll go for the support. Okay. Let's go design vehicle. Um, design new. We want an upper stage, right? We picked this one last time, right? And it was fine. And then we want a booster, which we picked this one, and it was fine, I think. And we'll name uh, Hello Heliconium. Yeah, we'll leave the name. That's fine. Confirm. Build vehicle. Right, next event. Open Skies Debate. A global symposium is taking place to establish laws regarding ter territorial space for orbiting satellites. The proposed treaty states that all nations should have free access to space. Your advisors believe supporting the treaty will improve diplomatic relations with the other space agencies, though opposing it may prove popular with sections of our media. I think we support the treaty. Next event. Your agency performance over the last 12 months have been reviewed. Yeah, we're getting 100k per month now. Nice. Got a million now. Fantastic. Next event. Your engineers discovered a manufacturing error in your key component. Oh, for God's sake. I'm just going to replace the component. We have mission control. 70% launch reliability. Uh, training. Can we give more training? What's this? Payload reliability. Launch reliability. Yeah, I'm going to do launch reliability, I think. Because they keep fucking blowing up. Why is it 3% there? 6% there? Oh, I guess each time you go up, it goes up more. Fine, that's alright. Confirm set up. Set research. Uh, let's do... Let's do... Do satellite imaging. Why not? Okay, next month. Here we go. Second rocket. Let's hope this one doesn't just fucking explode, eh? Kind of getting fed up losing them. Launch day. Continue.
and off it goes. What a nice day. Nice, we actually got one somewhere. Battery damage. Minus one power for duration of the mission. Do you ever get a clean launch? I don't think we've ever had any launch that either hasn't exploded or had a problem. Right, collect three comms and one data. A bonus if we can get five comms and three data. Um, let's see. We can do the atmospheric sampling. We get two turns. Got one for that, but then we used it again. Oh no. God damn it, something else broke. These things never go how you expect them to go. Never how you plan. It's ridiculous, it really is. I can't even do this now. Why can I not do this? Okay, we'll do that one. And that one maybe. Hmm. Hey, not that one then. Uh, let's try... This one. Yeah, we go with that. 52 oh, well, that's fine um oh. another failure god damn it um okay what can we do next that okay we got the atmospheric sampling this time almost really good there we've got three of those this is the last turn we need to do this and that's pretty much all we can do That will use one data and we'll get two of those. Let's hope this works. Oh my god. Really? We could resist it. We get them two. But I don't think we got the bonus though. Well, kind of sucks. Well, we can build mission control, which we could put. Yeah. Okay. Um
We need to put somebody in space. We need to put an animal in space, and we got a request. High altitude photography. We we haven't we we're, we're unlocking um, satellite imagery, right? How can we do this? Can we can we do that? How can you put a It needs to be a sounding rocket. How do we put on a... How do we put a camera on it? International Geophysical Year. The International Geophysical Year, a global initiative to gain more geophysical data on Earth, is taking place in three years' time. Organizers have requested that your agency launches a satellite to collect the re required data. If accepted, your agency will expect you to complete the satellite imaging mission within three years of the current date. You will receive 750k immediately and 750k if successful. Um, let's accept it. And we do our satellite imaging we've done, so that's great. Launch preparations. Right, can we do... Do launch reliability again because you know, and we'll do it here, right where we need to do it. Set research data, right? Let's do human in space, and then we'll go next month. launch mission let's not have it blow up this time the nighttime mission intrepid little rocket goes off to the heavens again hopefully it made it woohoo we actually didn't get any issues the first launch without a single issue. Fantastic. Level four. Mission complete. Nice. Right, we'll leave it there. I don't know how long this video is, so we'll leave it there for today. Um, and I'll see you in the fifth one. Thanks, bye.